Hello and welcome my friend and then I am planning to show you that how to replace this Honda Cars 1.8 liter gasoline engines these spark plugs and these spark plugs are good to replace within every three years or then 50,000 miles 50,000 kilometers uh, sorry this miles or about about 70,000 kilometers and then our car runs better and of course use similar spark plug what you had in there this is good advice or then purchase these Japanese Tensos uh, these spark plugs or NJG is also good okay and let's go to do the job okay and first step is to take out these electric connectors in here one two three four and we have to press that up area and then pull out that in this way normally when we are lucky this opens but sometimes these can be really tight and that's we need specific tools and let's go to look at what are those tools okay now we have nice view and these connectors really work so that when I press this area then I move that in up in this way in that way but sometimes these parts are stuck and I have to press this area and install this my hook tool in here and little bit lift up this central area in that that way now it is in in here in this way and then I move that in here and then this opens because sometimes these are stuck and then I open this final two press in here and, and then move up and press in here and now all of these opens nicely good and next step is that I need 10 millimeter socket what fits in there and in these positions I can open these poles in this way this is rotation and there is the small nut and now this bolt is free and let's open next bolt Okay, and then when nuts are away, I carefully move that and I pull out and this is really ignition coil and it goes nicely out in that way and that way and in this way and in same way. And when we install this back, it is same procedure in this way. And let's look closer this type of this this ignition coil. Okay, and then next part is that we have to take these spark plugs away and we need now tools what are firstly socket for spark plug removal 1 6 16 millimeter and then longer bar extension and when I install these things in that way and I carefully install that this my tool in there this is ready for opening and then I take my rings and I, I open this spark plug in this way a little bit rotation and when you lift up this spark plug be carefully that you don't drop this okay and there is all spark plug in here and now we can next look closer the spark plug. Okay, and there is really this old spark plug, and we can purchase just similar than this old one. My one is Boss Maker, and there is this code in this area in here, and this is made in Germany. And when we choose just similar code text what are in here then we can get good spark plug and also we can purchase 
like Densos spark plug so that we go to internet page and there is Densos spark plug selector tool and then we can purchase Densos spark plug. I recommend always Densos, Densos spark plugs because it is it is same in all Toyota cars also. But this boss is fine also. Okay, okay, and then spark blocks installation pack. And when we install this spark blocks pack, note that use socket where is magnetic inside magnet because it keeps this spark plug in like place and and it is really critical that when we install this spark plug carefully in this hole that do not drop this spark plug in there because otherwise this nose this head this can damage and then we have those engine running problems okay and that that is this is the way now there is this magnet in inside in here. This is specific socket for spark plug. And now I carefully install this my spark plug in this hole and then I can rotate that in my hands. Or if we have this electric driver, now carefully this start is carefully job. And now when it stops, I take this my electric driver away and then we take this reins and when we use this reins this is quite okay we can change this spark plugs using this reins but we have to be careful that this is small reins because if we tight and rotate this spark plug too much it can damage and go totally broken and it is then really bad situation and that's we should to use torch friends tool because this force is 20 newton meters or something like 15 one wife lpf this force like 20 newton meters and it is possible to get when I use one hand only in here and then in this way now there's about 20 but let's check when we have we can loan or purchase this uh, this torch friends tool what like in I, I have in here this digital, and now when I move that, that my tool, it says sound when force is okay. You can see in this my tool that there is this digital amount newton meters, and when there is this sound, now 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 I have a little bit more this force in there it is about 30 and that's I have to release a little bit is my my spark plug in that way and I repeat that and let's check again okay and now there is 20 in here and we look that amount and this means that when there is 20, this is this is just great amount of this force, 20 newton meters. Okay, in here. And now we can be sure that this spark plug is fine. Okay, and then when we install this ignition coil back, there is similar thing that I installed this carefully in here and then when I install this nut in here there is force what is 
10 to 15, 15 newton meters. Now I rotate that in here and we can look that closer. And this nuts force is 10 to 14 to 15 newton meters. And let's check using my thoughts friends tool. This is this amount. And when we use this torch friends tool, then we don't broke these nuts and bolts. And now we can see that how much this force is. Now we can see that there is digital meter. Now there is like 11, 13 and 14. 14 is like maximum amount. And let's look closer. The good force for that ignition coil nut is about 10 to 15 these newton meters. Newton meters. Now there's 15 just in here. Great. And now we have just excellent amount of force in this ignition coil. And I can remove this my tool. And next I can install this connector. And next I install this connector. And this connector goes nicely when I take two fingers and then it goes only one way in there. And then I have to press this my connector so long that we hear click sound. Click. Listen. Okay, now, now there is no any click sound. But now it's fine when we look that this inner central area is deep and this connector works when I try to take this out and pull out but it is not possible. Then it's like locked and this locked is important. Okay, and now this coil is back. This was this idea. Thank you.